All right, got my lemonade, got my popsicle, cause I'm like five. Keep buying popsicles from the store because you know what? I don't care. I mean, mm. Mm hmm. I mean, it's good. I like popsicles. Cold. Why did I bite that? Mm. That was really cold. Huh, who would have guessed? Frozen liquid would be really cold. Oh. I was wondering why I wasn't hearing sound. That would probably help. Mm. Isaac kept to himself, drawing pictures and playing with his toys as his mom watched Christian mm. broadcasts on the television. I mean, you guys are hearing Life was simple. all the binding of Isaac noise, but... That was until the day Isaac's mom heard a voice from above. Okay, uh... Let's turn the music down, because I feel like I have it way too loud for... Uh, do I usually have it at one or two? When I did, I have it at one or two. When that's fine. It's just let's turn the sound effects up. Um, let's go to this. And I feel like I could use this. No. Yes, it does work. I wasn't sure because game capture sometimes doesn't work for certain games. Apparently, this one it does. Uh, don't have this one. Mm. Cool. I think we're good. I don't know where my webcam should be for this one. I don't know. I don't need this anymore either. Oh. Mm. Mm. Okay. Think I'm good. Think I'm good. I don't know whether I want to do regular, like just a regular run through. What characters do I have locked yet? I was trying greed. That one sucks. That's why I have a win streak of negative six. Although to be fair, before I did greed. I did have a win streak of like negative 25 and then I won one and somehow somehow won one Azazel Lazarus got okay. Lilith beating greed mode with Azazel that's why I was doing this I wanted to unlock Lilith I want to unlock the last character uh, I feel like this is blocking a lot if I have it up here oh don't move that move that uh, so I could put it here, because then I'm not blocking anything. Although I need to finish my popsicle. This my popsicle. Is there anything up here? Up in... Up in this corner? Oh, God. It looks really weird. Oh, I can't resume because I'm... I don't know. Oh, yeah, the map's up in that corner, so I don't want to block that corner either. Hmm? Got fair my popsicle. Oh. This is a bad idea. Oh, placenta. I love placenta. Hmm. This is a bad idea, because now I kind of have to finish this. Before I'm able to actually, like... That's the one thing that sucks about Azazel. I mean, I love this attack because it's so strong. But you have no range. Oh, brain freeze. That's why this was a bad idea to eat a popsicle right, right and having to do it quick. I mean, I had the back of the bit thing up. I could have just waited. I could have just eaten the popsicle. Then come back in and been like, oh yeah, I had a snack. I'm good. Oh. Oh. I I genuinely got like bad brain freeze from that. Mm. 
Oh, and to prove more that these these things are for five year olds, I have crappy jokes on them. Why do vampires love baseball? They like to play with bats. God damn it. It's on my bed now. It's probably making my bed all juicy. Not like that. I'm pretty sure my mind I'm the only one whose mind went there, but Okay, greed mode is different from the main game main game of Binding of Isaac. I think this one was added with Afterbirth. Oh, fucking hell. I think this one was added with the Afterbirth DLC, but it, it works differently in that it's it's not a maze. It's not like cuz usually it's about, you know, finding the boss, finding different items and all that stuff. No, all of the floors are laid out the same. The difference is you basically, it's like you fight waves of enemies, you get money from that, and then you have to buy items based off of that. Now, usually when I'm doing this, I have a guide up to know what each, items, each item does, because I don't remember off the top of my head what all the items are for. And I've lost all of my health. Luckily, I had the freaking placenta, so I didn't die i've never once in my life i've never once thought i would say that sentence thank god i had the placenta oh god i hate so the title that i put for this is fine the title i put for this in twitch for anyone that hasn't seen it or for anyone watching the youtube video the youtube recording of it is eric dies to poop way too many times I almost just died to poop. Like, that's not supposed to happen. I feel like I should get that heart. Oh, never mind. I'm glad I didn't. The common cold. Poison damage. Does that turn my laser green? Yes, it does. To be fair, that's not really a great... Wet, uh, a great... Uh, it's not too bad. See, now what I did there... I didn't do anything. I had to do that. Never mind. You have to face, like, a bunch of enemies, and then you face two bosses. Somehow, like, with this with this character, with Azazel, it seems like the bosses, to me at least, are way easier than the regular enemies. I feel like the regular enemies, usually because there's so many of them, the, your weapon, like, the fact that you have, like, decreased range and all that, really hurts you. Okay, I got that, which I think is Thunder Thighs? Maybe? I don't really need that, but do I need this? Chaos! The Devil, Revel in the Power of Darkness. Hagal's Destruction, Mother is Watching You. Let's see, I could go here, visit the Devil. Oh, that wasn't what I thought it was. I thought that was the one that led me to the Devil Room. Shit. Okay, well I can go in here, get some keys. Because I guess, I guess it's a secret thing with him, or, or not a secret thing, but like a power with him, with uh, Zazel. I've got to move this monitor back. I, I have this monitor moved up when I'm doing console stuff because it, uh, it has the webcam on it. I don't need it like right next to my face now. I, I can have it as far away, I can have it in its normal position. But uh, Zazel, when he goes through those, those spike doors, he, uh... I guess doesn't gain damage going into them, just gains damage coming out. Okay. See, like, the bosses are so much easier than regular enemies, I feel. I mean, I mean, it also depends on the boss, because if it's one that it sucks, like, you can't really get close to them ever, then you're going to be screwed anyway. Okay, let's go into here, because sometimes he has... Oh, well, I'm so glad I went into there. Oh, fucking hell. I ran right into the spiders. Why did I do that? Clearly, I suck at this game. I don't think there was any doubt about that. Oh, Bob's Rotten Head. I actually really like that item. Oh, another bomb item. Prize bombs. So I'm assuming that means I get stuff from bombs. <gasps> Cricket's head! 
I don't know if I want Cricket's head because I think Cricket's. I I need to open up. Like I really don't want to, but I need to open up the guide, or not the guide, but like the uh, like the wiki and the thing. Uh, just because I Azazel's not really the kind of character that you want to lose range, and I think Cricket's head. Does not okay. I think I think it's Cricket's body that uh, reduces the range. Cricket's body, I think, is the one that reduces the range. I need to actually click on the game again. So go for Cricket's head. Damage up, done. That's ideal. Uh, let's do that. Prize bomb. Oh, I didn't get anything. Well, I might as well use one here because I'm going to get them. I just remembered I don't need to use bombs for that. I can fly. Because I'm Zazel. Oh, fuck. I always do that in greed mode. If you step on the button again, af like it, it'll deactivate naturally. But if you step on the button to deactivate it early, it uh, you you get damage. Like, you get damaged from it. I always forget that and then immediately accidentally step on the bomb okay well i missed everything right there uh let's use that that's why i was using that i might have used it like way too early i probably should have waited but i think it persists for the room i don't think it i think that's one of those it doesn't only hit once it hits like multiple times as long as you stay in the room Okay, these guys are not too bad. Oh, never mind. They grew really fast. Holy crap. They grew way faster than I wanted them to. Uh, go this way. Shoot them. And we're not dead. We are not dead. Oh, there's a lot of poop, which means it's this dude. I hate the- I hate him. I hate this enemy. He's so- He wasn't as bad, to be fair. Like, usually he is so, like, a pain in the ass to kill. Because he does, like, charge attacks and all that. That's why I hate the poop enemies. Another sentence that I never thought I would say. But I hate the poop enemies because they- They do these, like, charge attacks that are just- a so annoying. This is good. HP up. Raw liver. That was good. Another head. What the fuck? There's another head? The other thing with greed mode, you kind of want to also save your... Save your weapons? Or save your... Uh... Oh, I don't like this guy. I can't really get close to him easily. You kind of want to save your uh, coins too, because at the end you can put them into a machine and basically get a ton. Of oh, an angel room! That's the f genuine. That's genuinely the first time I've ever gotten to an angel room in this temporary buddy generator. I really like the bomb. They both have the same charge time. The buddy may or may not be helpful. The bomb probably will be most of the time. But, um, that's the first time I've ever seen an angel room in this. I mean, I haven't played green mode too much, but I've always gotten a devil room there. Let's go in here. Oh, have it! Item martyr. I don't remember what that means. That may or may not be a bad thing. Spectral tears. You know what that means for me? Nothing. Because I think the spectral tears are the ones that go through items, if I remember correctly. Uh, well, mine can already do that, because I have the laser. Okay, so, I need a bomb for that one. Get a key, and a thing, and all this stuff. Now, I could either use... I don't know what these do. This looks like something useful. Missing page two, evil up, your enemies will pay. Alright, then. 
Bombs are plenty. I don't know what I was about to say there, but it wasn't a plenty. Oh, poop. Oh, poop. Well, you're kind of poop. I don't know what you're supposed to be, actually. Okay. Got him. I'm actually not doing as bad as I thought I would do. Especially considering the first... Oh, God. Especially considering the first floor did not go well. If I could beat this... Somehow. And, and unlock Lilith. That would be great. I think after this one, I'm gonna just do a normal game, though. Whether, whether I'm Azazel or whether I'm, like, Lazarus or someone else. I want to be someone that I haven't beaten the heart with yet. So I can get that mark. Oh. I went too close. I thought, I thought the range was less... Oh, and I still have the poison damage. I forgot because it's not green anymore. I kind of forgot that it wasn't... It was still poisonous. Did I go in there? Yes, I did. So that's the card generator. I don't know what this is. I don't know... I don't know what the missing page did either. A lump of coal. My Christmas present. Oh. I'm sad. Ah! What are you? I threw a bomb at you. It didn't work. Oh, I stepped on the button. Oh, he's actually pretty damn weak. I panicked, threw a bomb, missed, and then stepped on the button. That did not go near as well as I wanted it to. But now I can heal. So, uh, wasn't too big of a deal. What the hell? I'm running into all these enemies that I've never seen. All these bosses that I've never seen. I don't know if they're the kind that they only appear in greed mode. Or if they are just... I, I just haven't seen them. Like, I've played a decent amount. So I figure I would have seen them if they were, appeared in not greed mode. But neither of those two bosses I've ever seen. I mean, I feel like I'm doing pretty good. I can do... Oh, Okay. This one's actually not too bad. Especially as it's Azel, it's really not that bad. If I can keep away from the spiders, that's actually not that bad. I just need to not screw this up. Oh god! Uh, okay, never mind. Apparently, if you go for the big ones, because they just split all over the place. I mean, it still wasn't that bad. I say wasn't as if I already finished it. Okay, now I finished it. Devil Room. Oh, I could get Guppy. See, I don't remember what these do. I know that one shoots stuff. That one, I don't feel like I have the health for it. I have three hearts. I don't feel like that's enough to be making deals with the devil. For items that I'm not even entirely sure what they do. I mean, I know they were all helpful, but I don't remember off the top of my head what they do, so I don't really want to risk it. Circle of protection. Protect me from myself? Kill of me! I desperately want to get... Like, six cubes of meat or six bandage balls. I've never really played... I, I mean, I have a little bit, but I've never heavily played Super Meat Boy. But I know enough that I want to get all of the bandages and uh, bandage balls and all that stuff. Okay, spoiled milk. I think that HP up. Breakfast. That's what it was. Breakfast. That's a caffeine pill. That's not useful. Spectral Buddy, really not useful with Azazel. I mean... He could be. I guess I could see why he would be useful in certain situations, but he's usually not. I mean, to be fair, for me at least, he's not usually useful any time. But especially with Azazel, he would not be. Let's go. You know? Yeah, don't cry at me. Oh, more of them. I don't think I'm affected by that. No, I'm not. I'm not affected by the goop they drop on the ground. I forgot about that. Because I'm, I'm flying. Oh! I... 
Okay, so the Circle of Protection activated a few times, but I'm not sure how. I'm not sure what it did. Is it if I kill them while they're in the Circle of No, because he just... Oh, God. Oh, God, there's so many of them. Okay, this got tougher. Not not as if this was as this this was easy before, uh, but it got ridiculously tougher. There's so many of these ghost heads. That duds, dods, dudes. Oh, go for it! Holy hell! Uh, let's not go in there because I got a heart in here. I got two half hearts in here, so I don't really need to go through the door just to get healing. Uh, yeah, neither of those are useful. Really. Oh! Is this, uh, Envy? Or is this Pride? I think this is Envy. Like, Super Envy, or something like that. So the Circle of Protection, I think they get hurt while they're in the Circle of Protection. I don't know what that purple was. Like, I don't know what the purple was. Like, the purple balls that shot out. I don't know if the circ if that's like something with the circle of protection. Like it has a chance to uh like th that's the thing. I kind of really like greed mode because I feel like it's really helping me learn way more about the game. Because there's so much stuff that I didn't Oh no. It's this guy. It it's like bouncing back some some projectiles. Yeah. Take a bomb, bitch. Okay. We're good. We're good. We got it. We're good. Didn't do too bad, actually. Anything on sale that I should get before I go to the next floor? I feel like I need to do this. I, I, I feel I, I feel like I'd be considered a wuss if I didn't go for the uh the uh super Oh I'm not gaining I, I I thought I was gaining stuff by uh I'm gaining power by getting hit. I don't know if that's an Azazel thing, I don't know if that's a green mode thing, or I don't know if I got a Oh I got a page. Oh, that was the, uh, page. Maybe I get, I get extra, I do damage to them if I hit one heart. Is that what that does? Oh, I can avoid their ground attacks if I'm over the thing. I guess that makes a lot of sense. Shut up. Go away. Angel room. Let's go in here first. Ooh. What the hell's the gold heart? That seems very useful. What the hell does it do? Again. First time I've ever gotten that. I probably should have waited to use those to get hearts until the next floor. Just because uh, I'm not sure. So the collar, more breakfast. Oh, it doesn't matter. Nothing's on sale. Get rid of this so it doesn't kill me. Oh, petrified poop. Well, I don't have anything else, so might as well. Not entirely useful, since I'm not going to run into rooms where there's just a ton of poop. Uh, the collar, I feel like it could be... Oh, another breakfast. Another breakfast or the collar. I don't know what the collar does, so I'll go with another breakfast. I feel like I'm wasting way more money than I should be. I needed a key. Okay, that... Increase the HP. I don't know what this does. You feel guarded. Oh, I think it guards in front of me. Like, wherever I'm aiming. That's good. That's actually very good for him. Because I need to get close to... I don't know whether it guards from enemies or whether it guards from... Projectiles or both. Like, I don't know whether it guards from physical attacks or just ranged attacks. I guess both because I just killed that okay it does do both but uh, probably not best to use it against charging enemies 
they probably will still kill you. Uh, so there goes my gold heart. I don't know what the hell happened there. Oh, oh my god, that is so useful against them. The skeletons, I hate the skeletons because they are... They are really good at hitting you multiple times before you even have a chance to hurt them. From my experience, at least. Because I suck. But, uh... Okay, last, last wave before the boss waves. I can go get a key and actually open the gold room. Which is good, because I kind of need to do that. I don't need to, but I want to. I want to see what's in there. I don't really want either of those items, because I don't remember what they do. Blue map! You know how useless that is in this, in this case? Very useless. Oh no, never mind. There's a secret room over here. Are there... There's secret rooms in this? I didn't know there could be secret rooms in greed mode. So there's that, which I think gives me a chance to not have... Not use a key. Which could be good, because then I don't have to buy keys. And then this one, which gives me a fly. If the... If I break a thing of poop. Which won't be really that useful, because again, there's not much poop any anywhere. Let's get the paper clip. I feel like that's way more useful. Let's go through here, too. Like, oh no! I didn't react in time. I need to find a match now, because I got a tick. God damn it. I, I, I saw it was a tick. I ran into the thing. I saw it was a tick, but didn't have time to react before I picked it up and screwed everything. God damn it. Son of a bitch. I actually had a good item, too. It, I had a not bad item, at least. Well, he was easy. Gotta go for it. I got two ragmen. Who I killed one already. And uh, now just Monstro 2, I'm assuming. I think, it's, I think this is 2. I don't think there's any more after him. After 2. Any more Monstros, at least. Well, he's dead. <sighs> Another devil room. Got soul hearts, so that's good. Let's just leave. I'm upset at the tick I have. Now this level could be a bitch. I know because I've gotten to this level and this is as far as I've gotten before. can't pick that up probably because of the tick this is why I oh that was only two wow that's great Ooh, I think that's actually good I think that's actually good quad shot how does that work with him the shot speeds down hold on that's awful why did I get that I just fucked myself over. I mean, that's gonna do a ton of damage. That's gonna be great against bosses. But against normal enemies, that's just completely useless. It slightly widens my... Good thing I have, like, the the shield and stuff. It slightly widens the amount of, like, the amount of damage I can do. Like, the uh, space I can shoot. And that's about it. Although, if I do get the hit on, like, if I do get the hit, it destroys them immediately. Holy hell. Like, that actually, that might have been a good thing. Inadvertently been a good thing. 
Um, so... These guys suck. Um, um... Hit some of them. Well, that's not a good thing to hear. That's why. Wait, do can I not get hit, hurt by that? I don't know. I, I might not be able to get hurt by that because I can fly. Well. I don't get hurt by that. Why was I trying to avoid that with all the other enemies? Okay, so bosses is where this the quad shot's gonna shine, I think. Well, wasn't too useful. I could get another breakfast, but I kind of want to save my money at this point. I ran over the button. Well, I took him out immediately. And then time. I don't know what that did, but... I ran over the button. I don't really need health. Oh, he's gonna be... He's gonna... Oh, there's multiple. I did not realize there was gonna be more enemies than just the one. Take him out, because he's a pain in the ass. These guys, less so. Yeah, they were less of a pain in the ass. Let's get more money. I don't think I get more money from that. I think I just get the, uh... Devil rooms and such. Okay. Now I just need to get rid of the tentacles. So yeah, it looks like if they're in the circle of protection, they just... Take damage. Well, that's easy enough. Angel room! That's always good. That's exactly... Oh my god. I got all the money ever. Now I think I need to... Fa I actually might beat this. First try. Well, first try today. Because uh, clearly I've tried this before and failed miserably. Yeah. Take him out. Okay. This is going to be super greed. I don't know if I just face ultra greed. Sorry. Do I just face ultra greed, I guess? Let's charge this up. Holy fuck! I don't think that was ultra greed because there's another boss door. But holy hell! I one shot at him! Yeah, this is ultra greed. I mean, I'm still doing a pretty damn good amount of damage to him. I mean... It's... Way better than I could probably hope for. I don't know what the hell is happening. Oh, he healed! I didn't know what they were doing. So he drops coins, which does stuff for him. Oh, he's gonna open doors. Oh god. Oh god, I should have broken the coins. I should have broken the coins. I should have broken the coins. Oh, good thing I have the shield. It's actually really helping. He's st I can still damage him, which is good. This actually might be a really good opportunity to do as much damage to him as possible. Oh, God. Okay. I did destroy a few, so that's not too bad. Oh, God. I may actually do this. I have a bomb! What am I doing?
Mm, destroy as many of them as possible. I am losing health left and right. Oh god. Oh, I see. Those coins he doesn't absorb. They just attack. Oh god. I might actually beat him though. Damn it. God damn it. I'm not gonna beat him. I'm not gonna freaking beat him. Oh god. That helped so much. Ah! I was almost there. If I didn't. Oh my god. I mean, if I didn't get the quad shot, it would have been a little. It would have taken longer, but I feel like because I would have had the higher charge rate, it would have been so much easier. God damn it. Okay, I'm just gonna do a new run. I'm just gonna go into, uh... <sighs> Let's be Eve. I haven't been Eve at all. Let's, uh, make sure I'm doing hard mode. Because you know what? I want to fail. That's probably the best. The best, uh... I don't know what any of the items she got. She got the... Bird and something else. The Whore of Babylon, it said. I don't know what either of those do. I mean, they're not usable items. They're not. It's not a trinket, and it's not an active item. It's a pass. They're both passive items. So, but I don't know what they do. It's so weird not having the laser and just being able to like one shot anything a anymore. Yeah, yo, go away, go away. Stop trying to charge me, S son of a bitch. Okay, take this guy out, because I think he's the last one. Cool. What do I get? The heart! Which is HP up, which is good, because I only had 1 HP. Or 2 HP. You know, the number between 1 and 3. Uh, oh god! I love how the- I love how going invisible is- his special. Despite the fact that I can clearly see him and he don't move around, so it doesn't even really help anyway. Like, the, those, they don't move. He dropped a battery. Great. I can use that for the item that I don't have. I need bombs. So I can open up some of them. Oh god. There's a big one. There's a big one, a small one. Oh, the small one's fast. Just like the freaking zombies from... in Minecraft. Oh, the dead bird goes after him if I get... hurt. Well, that is insanely useful. Let's, uh, keep doing that. So if I get hurt, I don't know if it's, like, just for the room. Well, I guess we'll find out. I don't know whether it's just for the room or it's... yeah. I didn't know whether it was just for the room or just as long as I have, uh... Less than max health. Get that one. Oh, cool. I gained... I... I... Gained no bombs, but I gained some coins. Oh, God. This one's gonna suck. This is where Azazel would be very useful, because, uh... He would just be able to fly up and... Just shoot him. Like, he wouldn't need to... He... They wouldn't be able to hit him, because he'd be able to be over the rocks. Oh, I got flies. And they immediately attack, attack the meat chunk. Not even the strong meat chunk. The, the weak one that I probably could have killed easily. Well, that one attacked that one. So, uh... I guess I ran out of flies already. More of these guys. Ugh. Cool. Well, I'm a, I mean, I'm always four free coins for doing absolutely nothing. Oh, I'll I'll wait. I'll wait until after the boss, because the White Heart, for anyone that doesn't know, basically, if you get two, it works sort of like a heart container with like Legend of Zelda. You know, you have to get a bunch, and then you 
get a, uh, get another heart, you get more life. Although you only need to get two. The only difference is if you go to another floor, if you have one, it automatically gives you another heart. It gives you more life. So I kind of want to wait until the the issue is after if you get hit once, if you get hit and lose it, then you know you're screwed. God, this guy's. I haven't gotten any like power up items or speed shoot speed items, so this one's gonna be a little not difficult to do, but it's gonna be time consuming. I can tell because I have to get through his flies before I can actually hit him. Like I I hit his flies way more often than anything. Although he is almost dead. Oh god. Okay. We're good. We we got him. We got him and uh, surprisingly I haven't gotten hit yet. That's even more surprising than me killing him cuz I thought I could kill him easily. Didn't think I could uh kill him without getting hit. Dog food. Dinner. Sorry. Sorry. It's dinner. HP up. Let's get this so I'll get another heart container. So suddenly I went in one floor I basically went from two hearts max health to 5. It's always a good thing. I don't think I've ever said, you know what, I want less life. Except when I was trying to get Azazel, because I had to make deals with the devil, which require you to, uh... Waste... To use life to get... To make the deal. Although, to be fair, I still wanted more life, so I could make more deals with the devil. I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm just, uh, hoping that... Oh, fucking... I hate these guys. I hate these guys. Especially the ones on fire. Because they jump right at you. They're so quick. Oh god. Got him. Oh! Dead bird! Go for it! Help me! Help me! I'm trying to think of a name for the bird. I can't. I can't. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm not good at naming things. Hence why pretty much every character I ever do in any game is either Shadow Lily it's either Shadow or my own name, if it's a guy. It's Lily, if it's a girl. Unless it's a uh, female Khajiit, unless I'm playing Elder Scrolls and play as a female Khajiit, then I name it Kitty. Or if I can't, if I don't want to use any of them, I just name a character Moo. You know, not gender specific. It's just Moo. How could that be gender specific? I'm specifically gonna die right now. Okay, I'm good. I'm good. Good. We're good. Relax. Relax. So I need a key. So I can get through the uh, the gold door and get a, a hopefully good item. They ran into the fire. Are you... You've been sort of existing in this room until I got here, basically. And you run into the fire that you should have known was in the center of the room. You dumbass. Let's get rid of those guys, because they're more of a pain in the ass than the fly shooters. Okay, flies, you can go for them. You know, you don't need to be... I, I, It's not like I would like to save you for the boss or anything, you know. Get that extra jump of health. Uh, there is one room that I haven't gone to. Hopefully there's a key there. Oh no, oh no, oh no. That was not gonna go well. Oh, there's multiple keys. Guess what? I need bombs to get them. You stupid. Oh, thank God. I can get at least one. Oh, no. These guys... I ran right into them. But to be fair, that activates the dead bird, so... I'm completely fine with that. Go for it, birdie! 
Steven. I don't know. I was trying to think of, like, any name I could think of. And Steven was the first one to pop. Oh, I could get both because... Like, I did that kind of subconsciously, like, getting both at the same time. Then realized, oh, wait, that's right. I can get both because the way it's positioned. Thinking. Blast damage. I got more bombs because of that, too. But that means my bombs are really... Oh, I turned into... Why does it say Mr. Mega? I turned into Bomberman. I would think if it was Mr. Mega, it'd be like a Mega Man-related item. I can go to the store. I did... I have, as you can see in the donation machine up there, 111 coins. I've up... Which means I would have had to upgrade the uh, store at least. I, I mean, I, I upgraded the store at least once because of that. Let's get this, too. And let's uh, put the rest in the donation machine. Until it either I run out of coins or it breaks. It's not breaking. Usually when I do that, I put in like three coins and it breaks. And that's, it's like, oh, well, that's all you can donate for that thing. Oh, good thing I got that. Oh, Bob's brain. That's good most of the time. But so many times in like a small room, I will accidentally explode myself here not so bad not so much because it's more open ish okay get bob's brain oh god i destroyed him with bob's brain devil room mom's coin purse i got all the pills now here's the thing should i do what i usually do and use all the pills and see what i get i'm gonna do that Look down. Health up. One makes you larger. Amnesia. Well, it's a good four to get amnesia on. The luck down, not so much. Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get the baby. Spectral buddy. That that's not that's not bad. He has spec I'm assuming he has spectral tears. Or puke, because he seems to be opening his mouth when he shoots. I'm assuming he has spectral tears, which is good. And I gained health literally five seconds before that, so... It's not even like it was... I was wasting anything. Yes! Brain, I needed to use you on poop. Thank you. That was useful. In multiple ways. Telepills. Ooh. Two hearts. That in doubles my hearts. That's good. Emperor brings me to the boss. The Fool brings me back to the beginning. Chariot is way more useful than any of those. Because the boss, I, I always search every room before I go to the boss anyway, so I get good items. So, Emperor is not really useful. The Fool bringing me back to the start, not really useful. They, they do have uses, even when you're exploring everything, but not, not really good uses. Like, they're not amazing. I exploded myself. Did I not say that? I at least thought it. That I was going to explode myself with the brain. Okay. Go for it. One makes you small. Well, that offsets the one makes you large. So why not use it? Oh. Twice in that room I exploded myself with the brain. So, uh... That's always great. Go for it, Bob's Rain! Wow. That worked way better than I thought it would. Spider, quad shot... For not Azazel, that's actually pretty damn good. Especially if I get some items that do shot speed up. That's going to be amazing. Plus I have Bob's brain, so that's always good. Oh god. Uh, I don't really want to use the chariot on these guys. I, I want to use that either if I get to like a mini boss room or even in the boss room. 
It's probably way oh fuck you. Taunt me with the key and then put it on the other side of a freaking hole. Screw you. I don't need your key. I feel like one of these is gonna be a secret room. One of these walls is gonna have a secret room behind it. Which one? I'm not sure. Speed down! That's always great. Fuck! The goddamn brain! I'm pretty sure this is exactly nothing. But if I curve my tears, I can put out the fire. Which, yeah, did absolutely nothing. Act absolutely. I don't know what I'm saying. Yeah, he does have spectral tears because he just shot through the rock. Are you freaking serious? The goddamn brain. This is why I wasn't like super excited about getting the brain because I always seem to blow myself up with it. Because it just spawns. Like it, it's gone for a while and then it just spawns and I completely forget about it and then next thing you know, oh, I'm dead. What a horrible night to have a curse. Um, that's Horror of Babylon, I forgot about that. See, what I tried to do, you notice I threw out a bomb. What I tried to do was this. Get some damage from that, which actually did not do much damage. So uh, that was completely pointless anyway. And then hit the wrong button and accidentally threw down a bomb. So that's what Horror of Babylon, Babylon does. Speed and damage up. I won't be Horror Babylon down here because I... Oh, I still will be! Oh! My tears are not red. So that's kind of suckish. I think I can get that. Yes, I can. Oh, uh, knowing how to manipulate the rocks in this game is great. I had a I had a black heart. When did I get that? Oh well, that didn't work. Oh, I need to do that. I ran out of bombs. The fucking brain! I was killed by this thing. No, I wasn't. Not that. I was killed by a fucking brain. And I love how the cool stuff's pointing right to Bob's brain. Guess what? You're lying. You're wrong. Completely wrong. Oh, good. I fight Lust right off the bat. Lust isn't that bad. In in an open area like this, I guess Lust isn't that bad to fight. Puberty! At least that does exactly nothing as far as I know. It changes your appearance. Appearance? I can't even speak right now. It changes your appearance, but it doesn't actually do anything to your stats. I need a bomb, because right there, that discolored rock will drop a soul heart. And I'll also be able to unlock a coin. Not ideal, but I can, I can do that. Okay. Uh, we're good. I have dropped a decent amount more frames. It, it must be our internet. Not that it's bad, but it's just not as good as it needs to be for me to stream today. <laughs> I think last time I streamed here, it was fine. Because I have streamed... I streamed on New Year's. No one was here on New Year's except me, if I remember. I think I was the only one here. I think everyone else was out, so that would explain it.
Um, okay, so I need to... Apparently there was a coin here that I completely missed. Oh, here's the gold room. I was wondering where the hell that was. Let's get, uh... What a horrible night to have a curse. It's actually not a horrible night to have a curse because, uh... Transcendent Tears? Oh, God! Dude, that's freaking awesome! I didn't know that was a thing. Can I, like... Do something? I don't have a bomb. I need a bomb. I want a bomb. Let's go in here. Oh, hey, I don't know why I use that because I can't open anything anyway. I can just donate one coin. Because I'm probably gonna die. With one heart. Although I do have, like, insane... Oh, nope. I'm gonna die. I was gonna say I have, like, insane damage now. But, well, I didn't die. HP tears up and shot speed down. Yeah, let's transcend. Let's transcend these tears. So, am I still the Whore of Babylon? Do I still have that? No, I don't, because now I'm above one heart. I don't know, does that last for the entire floor, or does it just last until I get above one heart of health? I guess we'll find out, or I'll die, and we won't find out anything. Oh, bomb. Okay. We actually aren't in as awful shape as it seems, I feel. We have some good items. Don't have any great items, but... Splash damage and tears up. That lowered my range. That That's what I was thinking of earlier. It did lower my range. I... Completely did not realize that Cricket's body gave splash damage. Because that could actually be pretty cool, especially if I'm below one heart. But, that's what I was thinking of. Cricket's head, I'm fine with. That still kind of pisses me off that I was, like... I was, like, a few shots away from beating Ultra Greed. On first try... As Zazel. That just kind of, that kind of sucks. But to be fair, I did, like I said, I did do way better than I thought it was going to do. I thought it was going to be much, much worse. Okay. I feel like I need to get the soul heart. I don't know if the soul heart counts toward... Well, never mind. I got a regular heart, too. I was going to say, I don't know if the soul heart counts towards uh, raising my health above that level. Or if it's... Okay, so yeah. As soon as I leave the room after getting above that many hearts, then I lose the power. Oh no, I did not realize exactly how close he was. I need some good damage up items. Or like, something that makes me fire like a machine gun. I know there's some items that really raise like, the tears. You know, give you tears up and then it's just chaos. Okay. I cleared out everything. Yeah, I could open up that. I can do this. Oh, I'm very glad I did that. I got more bombs and a soul heart. It's always a good thing. 
Let's go in here. Ah, oh, there's a map thing. Can't get that. Let's just donate the coins. I just really want to level up the shop even more. Just so I can, uh... <clears throat> so I can hopefully... Do stuff. Okay, get rid of this small ghost. Then the other two are going to come alive. And then just kill him. Can the bird go for him? Yes, there we go. I got close enough that the bird's now going for him. So he's getting damage from multiple sources now. Oh, the bird slows him, it looks like, too. Unless I'm slowing him with my with my tears. Speed and range up. Woo! I'm fast now. Is that the second one I have? Or did what well, no, the other one came in the last run through. Because I think if you get multiple shots, you get one of the transformations, because there's like a bunch of transformations you can get. Like, one that I keep wanting to get is to get, like, Guppy's paw, Guppy's tail, and Guppy's head. Because I think... Because basically you get three items you turn into Guppy. I want to be a cat. I want Isaac to become a cat. Or Eve, or anyone. I mean, technically, I think they're all Isaac, just different costumes. I mean, they all have different powers, but... I think the whole story is that they're basically all Isaac. Okay. We're good. We're good. The one weapon, the one item I got, not a weapon, but one item I got that was really, oh god. It was amazing. I got it, the last one that I won, I got. It's, uh, like a pony on a stick. It is. I think that's what it's called. And, uh, Basically, it gives you flight, and it's reusable where you can just charge at enemies. It gives you flight, I think it raises your speed too, but it gives you a reusable, it's like an active item where it, yeah, let's get him from the back. I got him from the back. That actually worked. I mean, not that I thought it wouldn't work, I mean, they loop. I got Pac-Man tears basically. I mean, they're not, the, the tears aren't Pac-Man, but they, uh, you know, like, you know what I mean. Like, the Pac-Man levels, you know, you loop through them. I'm just gonna shut up now. Okay. I almost got hurt by Tiny Poop there. Okay, I f can go out here and get this. A leaf. No odd leaf unbreak. Am I, am I, did I freaking pull a Mario and get a, get one of the leaves that I don't know, I don't know what the hell that does. Unbreakable? Can I break rocks now or something? Because to be fair, I mean, that was one of the things with that item in Mario. You could, I guess not. I don't know what that did. It just says unbreakable. It's another one of those items I've never gotten yet. And I can never tell when I don't when I've gotten an item that I've never gotten before. I can never tell whether it's one that I've never gotten just because I happen to have not seen it, because there's so many freaking items in this game. Or if it's one that I just unlocked, so I wouldn't have seen it. Like that I unlocked from like a previous playthrough, because I've unlocked like three items in the last playthrough. And I don't know if I've seen any of them. Dude, these... They, they, they are... They make the creepiest sounds. I don't know if I'd say the creepiest sounds in the game, but definitely up there. Just the... The low-pitched... Like, wow. 
low pitch like crying. So, uh... I actually don't mind... Oh, pride. So it was pride. And multiply my bombs. That was not a secret wall. I'm going to stop wasting bombs. I feel like I should go in there. Just on the off chance that it's not a store. It is a store. Because sometimes it's not a store. But you, usually those are the ones where it's like... Two keys to do it. But sometimes it's not a store. Sometimes it's... He's actually not going to be too bad. I mean, I only have... I, as soon as I said that, I realized I only had half a heart. Oh, I've been, I've been streaming for a decent amount of time. I think I'm going to do this run, and then I'm done. That kind of rhymed. I feel so much slower now. Because I, uh... I lost all my speed items that I had from the last run. Oh, that's right. He lays blood down that. If they step on it, they get hurt. So just keep moving. And these are the kind that they'll land exactly where I was standing. So they'll land ex like right on the blood. Okay. I gotta avoid his poison while I'm spreading my blood, though. I can see forever. Oh, sorry. I didn't do the voice. I can see forever. Oh, that's what that does. I was like, I don't... I, I thought it revealed everything on the map, but that's right. It just makes it so that all the secret rooms... They're revealed as soon as you go in. And you don't actually need to use bombs, then. Oh, there's one into the store. Awesome. A ladder. Oh, that lets me cross gaps. I may wait just to see. I, I'm going to donate my coins because I'm probably not going to be able to find enough. But I kind of want to wait just in case I find like another secret room or something that gives me a ton of coins. Two of hearts. Don't need that. I found another secret room. I heard the sound. These guys don't move, so the bloody baby doesn't really help here. Okay. Drive by. Drive by. Drive by. Okay. Take him out. Take them out. I think I can... I can, I can do this. I can do this! Can I get through this room without getting hit? That's the question. Chances are, no. But I have a two of hearts, so I can... If I lose one heart, I can use it and duplicate my hearts, which will bring me back to full health. Okay. Think, I think I'm actually doing a pretty good job here. Oh god, oh god, that almost ended badly. He dropped half a heart though, so I'm good. Somehow! I'm not picking that up. I'm not picking that up yet. I gotta, I gotta save that. Until after I beat the boss. Especially since it's right outside the boss room, so it's gonna be like, I beat the boss. It's gonna be pretty freaking easy to get. Missed the coin. Envy. Envy is actually really not that difficult. As long as you know what you're doing. Like, basically, you have to... He's asteroids. That's basically what he is. You just break up the big one. Break up one of the smaller ones. 
then break up the smaller ones of those. Because if you break up the bigger one, then you have four to deal with. This way, you have four, but one of them, two of them are going to be really small. And you can take them out. Although I think this one's almost broken. Yep. Okay, we're, we should be good. Like, I mean, I don't really have to worry about who I'm shooting now. Yeah, we're good. If I die or even lose health now, somehow, then I should just quit. I, I shouldn't even continue this playthrough. I should just quit. Oh, god damn it. Seriously? I kill Envy and all you're gonna give me is a freaking troll bomb? Who's the boss? Little Horn. I'm actually not too bad against Little Horn. Like, he's one that I'm actually not too bad against. Mostly because of the bombs. Like, if you learn how to manipulate his own bombs, like, hit him right toward him. I mean, sometimes he teleports away, so it doesn't really matter. But if you can learn how to manipulate his own bombs and just... You could kill him pretty quickly. Or he'll just sit and fire. And do, like, insane amounts of damage to himself. Plus, his attacks are pretty damn easy to avoid. There we go. Just like that. Hit it right at him. Lunch, HP up. White heart, which is gonna give me another heart container. And I have a two hearts, which is a pretty good healing item if I need it. I almost never do the, uh, the, like, uh, sacrifice rooms, like the one below where you, because basically you're losing two hearts, or no, uh, one heart, because you're losing two halves. I think a whole chunk of flies just flew into fire. You're smart. You're very smart. But, because half the time, from my experience at least, it's not worth it. If I have a ton of health, I'll do it. But half the time, it seems like it's not really worth it to... Like, the items that it gives you are really not great. Let's, uh, cover... Oh, he stopped right in the middle of it. He can't... Unfortunately, like, unlike Littlehorn, he can't get hurt with his own bombs. I got the dice shard. D6 plus D20, which... Does something. It, it, it controls drops in some way. Like, it, it re-rolls drops, but I don't remember. There's, like, the D4, the D6, the D20, the dice shard, and then there's, like, the D100. Nice. Ah, well, that worked, because I just wasted a bomb trying to use the dice shard. I re-rolled. Got a bomb. Kind of fine with that. Especially since it's useful right here. What is this? Attack fly. Oh! Okay. There was actually a uh, challenge that involved him. There's like so many flies that can just surround you. There's like the red, there's the red one, this one, that surrounds you like mid-range. There's two that surround you close range that block projectiles. And then there's one that surrounds you long range. And that's just the ones that just circle you. There's plenty of others. Other flies in that. Like the ones that you pick up that just attack enemies. That I've had plenty of times and have never actually helped. Never actually helped me. I found the bus room. Uh, I kind of don't want to use it. Go in there yet, obviously. Uh, any discolored rocks? Yes. Any bombs? Apparently not. That's right, I had one and I used it. Well, I had two. Well, I had one. I used it. That's the pill? That's mom's purse, which just drops a bunch of pills. There's not really anything good. I could get a soul heart, but I don't really need one. Oh, fuck. I might need one after I run into fire. 
140. I think I need to get 200 to upgrade the store again. I don't know. I, it goes up to 999, which gets you something. And apparently that's also good because you can bomb it. The donation machine, you can bomb it and it'll take out a bunch of coins. I think from what I read, it doesn't take out as many coins as it actually drops. It drops like... Like it might drop 20, 20 coins, but only take out 10. But that could be really good if you have the shop upgraded a lot, have really good items in there. And you're just like, well, I really want to buy this item, so I'm going to... I'm gonna blow up the donation machine, get some coins, and be like, be at that. Leave it at that. I'm gonna go in because I have so many pickups lying around. I have so many heart pickups lying around, so it doesn't really make sense to not go here. See, completely useless. Like that. It, it's one of those where it's 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 one of those. It's like a risk. Sometimes you're gonna get good items in there. But more often than not, from what I've seen, I've gotten awful items whenever I go in there. Like, I mean, you saw in the greed mode, when I was, you know, as Azazel, since he only gets hurt once going through those doors, he had some pretty good items in there. Like, there was a few times he had, like, two, just two keys, he had some hearts, and... Did he have hearts? That might not have been one in this video, that might have been one I did... Normal. But, you know, they have some pretty damn good items in there. But, I feel like most of the time it's not worth it. So the dead bird is really helping right now. Because he's going right after Ragman. Get him, Steven. Get him, Steven! Steven, kill him faster, please. I'm handling the, uh... Steven, kill him. Steven? Go for them, too. Thank you. Okay, matchbook. Evil up. That means something. Does that mean anything besides, hey, bombs appeared? Gonna guess no. Gonna guess no. I could have gone out and blew up the one rock and gotten another soul heart. Curse of the unknown, meaning I don't know how much health I have. God damn it. That's the one thing I hate about hard mode. Hard mode, I, I don't know if it's really harder... I mean, you do get some more difficult enemies, so I guess that answers my question right after I ask it. But you'll just get floors where it's like, oh, well. Oh, well, you can't see the map. You can't see the, uh, you can't see your health. You can't see this. It's like, God damn it! just let me see stuff. Holy hell. I had a black heart. I don't know how I had a black heart. When did I get that? Oh, evil up. I think it I think it gave me a black heart and I didn't realize it. One more wave, yep. Oh, I hate these guys. I hate these guys when they're coming in like in like hordes like that cuz it's hard to hit the one you want to hit. I got a lot of coins there. That was worth it. I got a lot of coins and I didn't waste any bombs because I think I I got all the bombs that I used from the from the thing. Oh god, I did not want to. Well, I mean, I at least have a soul heart. I know that much. Okay, let's hit this. I mean, not really useful when all of the enemies are already dead. But uh, I don't really have. I see the thing that sucks is I don't really have any good weapons. Like a good uh, like I haven't really gotten any like damage up items. I haven't gotten anything like that. I just realized though. Speaking of damage up, there's one really good thing about. Eve in these kind of rooms where I can't see my health, there's definitely an indicator of whether or not I have, like, of whether I'm at one heart or more. 
Because if I have more than one heart, I'm not going to be an evil demon. I forgot that was a thing for a minute. Oh my god, just die! You fat ass bats, go on a diet and then kill yourself so I don't have to worry about it. Underwear? That's a diaper. Number two. Uh oh. I don't know what that does. I'm assuming it's good because it was in a gold room. Oh, I just randomly dropped poop bombs. Alright. Are those like Bob's Bob's brain? Do I have to avoid them? Or like like can they kill me? Cause if so, that was an awful idea. Picking that up. At least at least Bob's brain. Cause Bob's brain didn't give you any things. Any, any, like, warning that it was going to go off? It just kind of appeared suddenly. This one, at least, you know, it appears, and then you have a moment to get away. Oh, yep, it can't hurt me. I heard the sound. Didn't register in my head that what it was until I got a pill. Range up. That's actually a good pill. Thank you for that. And it also, like, confuses them, and I think it does damage to everyone in the room. Because it does that, like, haze, but I can't remember whether that does damage to everyone in the room. I'm going to use the two hearts, because I think I'm low enough now. I think I was low enough where it would actually be useful. Fa. Let's uh, stick over here, because then it'll blow up that. I can just pick up that heart. Uh... Okay, coin, good. This is chaos, which I don't remember what that does. I don't think it really did anything useful, and I don't really care about a soul. I will take a soul heart. If I have money after this breaks, if this breaks, black candle has appeared in the basement. I unlocked a new item from the donation machine. Now I just need to, it broke with one coin left. So never mind that. I was going to say, I don't care who's online. I went busy. I should have just gone offline. I should have just gone offline. I'm taking forever now. Offline. There we go. That's so much better. Because I don't, I don't care who's playing what games. I'm streaming. It's completely useless information to me. Okay. Oh, I didn't realize the bomb went off. So yeah, it does hurt everyone in the room, it looks like. Ooh, what does the stars do? Does that lead... No, the moon leads me to the secret room. I don't remember what the stars does. I'll use it in the next floor just because I don't really want to waste it if it leads me somewhere that I already found. So use it like first thing in the next room. I, I, the thing is, I don't remember whether it's one that leads me somewhere or if it just drops items. Okay. Let's go for the boss. Is this only the second floor? Caves 1. This is the third floor, I believe. I was going to say, if this is only the second floor, then I'm not doing something right. So, there's two random... Okay, he's going to be easy because, first of all, he's on the ground, so he's going to... And he charges at me, so he's going to... Oh! That's awesome! I never saw that happen! He can eat bombs? Or, well, I mean, he's not supposed to, but... If he eats... You can fit, Dude, he's freaking Dodongo. But, like, easier to kill. Shot speed and damage up. Uh, see, this is dangerous not being able to see my health. And not remembering what either of those items do. So I'm not going to worry about that. I feel like I don't have enough health. Because I think I still only have four containers. I don't really want to drop lower than... Yeah. So I would have dropped a three. 
I really don't want to do that. Oh, oh. There was a thing. There was poop. I pooped. I pooped. I didn't realize I pooped. So, the stars. That's the bomb. I keep flipping those buttons. Oh, it leads to this room, so I'm actually really glad that I... I got the fucking spooky baby again. But I'm really glad I didn't use that then, because uh, it would have been completely useless. Pill! Speed up. I mean, you could argue that it was completely useless. Oh god, they are destroying me. You could argue that the that item was that card was completely useless now, but it, it, since I go to all the rooms anyway, but the fact that I got that item first thing was much better. I mean, to be fair, it's the spectral buddy. It doesn't really help too much, but uh, it's better than nothing. Go for him, Steven! Go for him! Save me! I mean, I am Eve. I could have just named the bird Adam, but, you know, that's boring. To be fair, this, this game, it has so, so much stuff behind it. For all I know, it could already have a name, that bird. I could be just completely wrong. Moon! Oh, it was right here. Oh! Damage reduction. That's actually a really good item. It's actually a really good thing to get. I've, I've never seen these enemies until this stream. I've never seen these enemies before. And now, now they're just appearing everywhere. I don't get it. Like, there's so many things just during this stream. Although, be, to be fair, anytime I play this, there's so many things that I just see that I've never seen before. Like, it, it's... It, that's one of the reasons I love this game. It's always a new experience. Like, no matter what. Even if you've beat the game, like, 50 million times, it's always gonna be new. I mean, that's kind of why I like randomly generated games like this anyway. But also the fact that it's not just randomly generated, you're constantly unlocking things. Like, like looking at the achievements on Steam, because the achievements on Steam correspond to like how many things you've unlocked. I, for the most part at least. There's like 200... I don't know if it's all items, like some of them are characters, some of them are different bosses and stuff. But there's like 200 things you can unlock. It's like holy hell. It's what? Hold on. Uh, after I beat this guy. It's, uh, I have 18% of the achievements. I have 50 out of 276. There's 276 things, distinct things that can be unlocked. What the hell is that? I don't have the money. But I'm curious. It's not worth it. I genuinely do not think this one would go on this long. I gotta check something quick. Because, uh, suddenly, it says I have zero dropped frames. Uh, but it's still streaming and still recording. At least I think it's still streaming and recording. Yeah. I'm still live, and it doesn't say... It says stop streaming, stop recording. So it must have... At some point, OBS was just like, you know what? Let's reset these. Let's reset these, uh... Dropped frame. The dropped frame counter. So I don't know if I've dropped any frames in the last... Unless it just got to a point where it's like, you know what? You're dropping too many frames. We're just gonna stop keeping count. We'll find out. I mean, I'm still live as far as I know. If not, then this is going to be a YouTube exclusive. <laughs> this is actually just going to be on YouTube. But, uh, it, it did say live. No one's told me that it's 
not live. Although, to be fair, I'm not sure if anyone's watching. Because I don't... haven't checked the, uh... list of viewers recently. And apparently it got hot in here. Appar it's been like... I guess I see why I needed to take my freaking hoodie off. It's been, like, cold outside for no reason. Like, it's freaking end of April and it's been cold outside. Like, to the point where it's, like, jacket weather. And suddenly, I'm gonna die. And suddenly, like, the last, like, what was I saying? It's been jacket weather. I knew I was gonna die. I knew it was gonna die. It's been jacket weather, even though it's been, it was like, freaking, what is there, daily challenge? Let's try this. I know I said it was gonna be done, but. Oh, it's, uh, I don't know what any of this, actually, no, I don't feel like doing that. Oh, no, I, I, I quit immediately and didn't end up last on the leaderboard. That's great. So, anyway, I think I'm going to, because I didn't realize I'd been recording for, or streaming for like almost four and a half hours now. Uh, I think I'm going to end this stream here. Uh, so yeah, stuff happened, fun stuff. Uh, let me go back to this screen. Um, not sure when I'm going to stream next. Maybe tomorrow? Maybe. Uh, we'll see. I'm not entirely sure. I, I definitely do want to keep streaming more often. I definitely want to not stream like once every four months like I've been doing. I, I want to stream more often. I'll definitely stream next Saturday, but I might stream tomorrow and maybe sometime during the week. One of those streams, I definitely want one of those streams to be Undertale. Because I just really want to do the genocide and true pacifist uh, ones for Undertale. I really want to get those to, to play those. I really want to see what the story's like with those. So uh, they might be the next stream. Who knows? Uh, they might be the next stream. One of those might be the next stream. I don't think I'm going to do both in one stream. But we'll see. Anyway. For now, I'm going to end this stream here, so thanks for watching. See you next time.